Hello and welcome to the weird one. Today's video is the unboxing of the June stroke July mystery box. The theme was the undead which my regular viewers will know that I am a huge fan of so I'm really excited about this box. It's also one of the boxes that was brought for me for my birthday so yay. As you may know this is a monthly themed box. It's $19.99 a month if you use the code CHICK in the checkout you also get 10% off so bonus it works out even cheaper it's a no subscription so you buy the months that you want or the themes that you like also before I open it uh, a new thing that they're doing now which I think is an added bonus is if you've bought the crate of the month and it's your birthday they will also add in a little small gift extra just to say happy birthday to you. So in my box there will be something a little extra which is not in every box because obviously it's my birthday month. But as mentioned this is the undead box so let's get in it and have a look. Oh look, they made it all birthday for me. <laughs> Okay, so it's in the box. Let's put the box to the side. There is lovely blue tissue paper. Um, this is because, like I mentioned, it's my birthday, so uh, you may not get this in yours. And then we have some newspaper for some padding. Okay, I believe this item is my gift, so I'm going to do this one last. Just so that we can concentrate on what you actually get in your box rather than the little extra that I got so that you know you don't get too confused okay the first item is a brain coin purse and on the zip it says mm, brains brains let's get it open let's have a look Let's have a proper look. And a zombie brain coin purse, as mentioned. Nice feel to it. Tissue paper. Nice green inside. As we all know, I love my green. So we have a coin purse. And the next item is... Yay! A cute Daryl Dixon The Walking Dead Funko little keyring. I do have this, but you can never have too many Daryls in my eyes. So I can put this one on my keys. It's the box. You can also get Rick in these keyrings. Put that over there. And the next item is an adorable little bag how cute is that I love it I'm not usually a bag person but this I love plus it helps to eat zombies okay so in the bag oh we have lots of goodies let's have a look we have a syringe pen and what's this we have a zombie outbreak response team sticker. I like that. And I love zombies. It's backwards because I believe this is a transfer. So you can put it on your t-shirt or your bag. Put that there. And more goodies in the bag. Zombie mints. I did actually have a look at buying these before and now I don't have to. And the last item in the bag. Ah, oh, sweet. Look. Surviving the zombie outbreak. Zombie survival playing cards. I love these, so no excuse not to know what to do. There's the packing. 
and the back examples of the cards filled with 52 useful tips and strategies this playing card deck is the must have for anyone looking to outlast the undead again I did actually look at buying these and they were quite expensive and I don't have to buy them now and of course the little bag is so cute that will come in very handy and what else do we have oh and the last item is pride and prejudice and zombies sweet I've actually heard that they're making this into a movie which I'm quite looking forward to I haven't actually read this so that would be a good the New York Times bestseller and there's the back and that is twelve dollars ninety five cents so that's about ten pound put that there so overall I love this box lots of stuff that I actually don't have which is quite rare because I do actually have quite a lot of zombie stuff I actually only have one item out of the whole lot so for me that is a complete bonus but as mentioned it was my birthday this month and because I bought the box this month they put in something a little extra so should we have a look yeah I think we should oh how cool is that look Michonne's pet number two again I do not have this I don't have many of the Pop Funko figures and there's the back and the others you can get as mentioned this item you will not get in your box this was a little extra for me because it was my birthday uh, I have seen on their Facebook page that this is something they are actually doing now so if you buy the box of that month and it's your birthday if you let them know they'll put something in it may not be a pop figure so don't get too excited but it's always nice when a company gives you a little something extra free just for being your birthday so yeah so i'm going to put this to one side because this you don't get in your box okay so let's look at what you actually get in your box now remember this box was 19.99 and i think the value is great I am slightly biased because I love this company, I love the undead, so this box for me is a complete win. So let's have a closer look. So the purse I would value at around seven to nine pound I've seen these go for. The keyring is seven to nine pound. The syringe set pen I would say about a pound. The sticker and transfer, I would price these at around £1 to £2. The mints I, as mentioned, did look into buying and they were £3 to £4. I love the tin. The playing cards, again, I looked into buying and they range about £7. The cute little bag I have never seen before. But I'm going to price that at around three to four pound. The book, as we saw on the back, was about nearly thirteen dollars. So in UK pounds, that's about nine to ten pound. I think in the UK, you can buy that book for about eight pound. But as you can see, overall, the value is great for the value of what you actually pay. I have to admit this is one of my favourite boxes I've ever had. Uh, the other box being also from Chick Crate and that was the Joker box and I loved that. August theme is Supernatural. So that will be something to look forward to. I will admit I'm actually quite looking forward to seeing what's in the box because I looked it up and it looks like a really good programme so I'm going to start watching that. So feel free to comment below on... What's your favourite item in this lot? What's your least favourite item in this? 
Um, for me, it's really hard to pick a favourite item because I love it all. If I had to pick one, it would probably be the zombie playing cards. Purely because I've been looking at to buy those anyway. My least favourite item, don't have one. I know it's rare, but... <laughs> I'll put all their details below, like their website and their Facebook page, things like that. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.